I'm Jared Wheeler with Sloan Implement, and today we're going to talk about Automation 4.0, which is a new activation that deers come out with uh, for the Generation 4 uh, family of displays. So if you have a tractor like we have here, uh, we've got a new 8R with the Gen 4 built into the armrest, so that's going to be a 4600 display. Uh, we've got the Automation 4.0 uh, unlocked on that tractor. If you have a 4640 display, then it's a uh, automation 4.0 subscription that's an annual uh, uh, an annual subscription um, now with that uh, above and beyond the premium 3.0 activation that's going to get you uh, four things uh, the first one is going to be auto path um, that's the newest uh, so that allows you to uh, use your recorded planting lines or strip till lines and then use those later in the season uh, so if you record strip till then you can come back and plant on the exact same lines and then you can come back later in the season and spray side dress harvest and using all of the same uh, the same lines so basically what it does is it is recording where all the crop rows are and then it uses the implement width to automatically generate the guidance lines that it needs for the entire field so when you get close to one of the lines you just pick it and go there's no more switching between different AB lines, uh, switching between boundary track, um, things like that. It's all just, uh, it knows where all the rows are and effectively generates those lines for you. The next thing included is machine sync. So that is uh, where you can have the combine and the grain cart synced up. So when the grain cart pulls up next to the combine, the combine driver can take control of the grain cart and effectively load the grain cart. So if you want to load it front to back, uh, or if they're over a road too far or too close, you can, uh, you can move them as well. Um, the next thing you get is implement automation. So with AutoPath and with the implement uh, guidance, you run a globe back on your implement. And then what that's doing is it's gonna steer your tractor off of the guidance line to keep the implement uh, on the line. So if there's any side-to-side -side movement of your implement, the tractor is gonna basically compensate for that. Um, so that's gonna come in handy for planting. Um, something like side dressing, probably not gonna to work too well because if the tractor's driving off the row, you're probably gonna be running over the standing crop. Um, and then the last thing is turn automation. So with turn automation, basically you need to have uh, a good boundary around your field and then what the, what you can do is you can set up different sequences for your uh, implement so for an example this spring we set up some uh, to where it would uh, whenever it got close to the end row it would uh, slow the tractor down it would raise the implement up and then it would make a full uh, turn on the end and then it would speed the tractor back up and put the implement back down in the ground and so the operator uh, doesn't really have to do uh, anything from there. So that's kind of a quick summary of Automation 4.0. For more information, uh, you can contact us uh, or visit sloans.com.